Hi, this is Amanda from Barocco, and today I'll be demonstrating how to knit a bobble, like the one I have on my sample here. A bobble is made by rapidly increasing the number of stitches you have in one place and then decreasing them all again, usually in the same row. There are a lot of different variations to knitting a bobble, but today I'm going to be working the type that we use in our free pattern wisteria. I'm using Voyage, which is the yarn called for in the pattern, and I'm ready to knit a bobble here on this first stitch on my left needle. So to get started, I'm going to knit the stitch, but instead of sliding the old loop off of my left needle, I'm going to leave it and move my yarn up to the front so that I can now purl this loop, even though I've already knit into it once. So now I have two stitches where I used to have just one. And now I'm going to knit it again, and that will make my third stitch. And then purl it again to be the fourth, and then knit it once more so that instead of one stitch there, I now have five. And now we're going to turn the work, and on the wrong side, we're going to purl all five of those new stitches. Two, three, four, five, and now we need to decrease back to one stitch again. So to do that, you want to slip the second stitch on your needle up and over the first stitch and off the tip of the needle. And then repeat that process with the third stitch, and your fourth. and the fifth. And now you're back down to one stitch again. And you can transfer this stitch to your left needle because you're done working with it. Turn around so the right side's facing you again. You can see the bobble is already forming here underneath the stitch I just finished working. And now I'm ready to continue on and keep knitting. So that's all there is to making a bobble.